Hey guys, today we're gonna do a review on the Double Up Roller. So if you guys have been subscribed to my channel, you guys probably saw the unboxing video that I did on the Double Up Roller. I got this product because I saw it on Instagram and I asked the company if they would send me their product for review. But after that, we had no prior agreement if I should do a positive or negative review. So these are all my own thoughts on the product. So let's talk about the Double Up Roller. This was made because the founder of Double Up Roller thought that there had to be a better way to foam roll other than just getting on the ground and rolling yourself in awkward positions, especially in public. But he thought that there had to be a better way to do it. So this is why he built this product. Uh, you could see that this is basically a lever action system with two rollers. So I kind of compare it to if you ever made pasta, you're going to be putting the pasta sheets in between two rollers, just similar to this and rolling and it gets an even pressure on both sides whenever you're rolling. So that's basically how it works. Let's talk about the different types of rollers that it has. It comes already installed with these two rollers. These are the medium density foam rollers. And then you have the soft density foam roller, the ribbed foam roller, and then the knobby head foam roller. This is great for uh, mild fascial release, especially break up all of those adhesions that that you get whenever you're a runner. So let's talk about how you switch it out. It's pretty easy to switch out the different rollers. You just simply press the button and take it out and put whatever one you want back on there. Like I said, you have the different options of the ribbed one or the knobby head one or the softer density one. One of the ways that I do like to use it is by usually having the softer density foam roller on there combined with a therapeutic one. And then I will roll the muscle group that way. I'll usually have the soft part on the area that doesn't need as much pressure and then the therapeutic part on the other side. So basically you could use this either way. If you want it on the left side, you simply flip it around and then now you have it on the other side. Basically the double up roller is mainly for your extremities. It's for your arms, it's for your buttocks, your lower legs, your feet. They really haven't found a way yet to massage your, your back uh, or your neck or, or that type of area. They actually say don't use this on your head or neck. So there is that. But other than that, I have to say that this is a really good product to massage yourself. I brought it out to a run recently and I let my runners use it and they all pretty much were surprised and shocked about how good it felt when they were rolling out their legs. And like I said, the founder of this thought there had to be a better way than rolling yourself on the ground. So that's why he made this foam roller so that you could use it standing upright, uh, which is great for runners. You don't have to get on the ground, don't have to get dirty, don't have to get a yoga mat out. It's simply just have to massage yourself that way. It comes with its own carrying case. This is the carrying case. Pretty, pretty big nylon looking material. Uh, yeah, it works as a carrying case. Let's talk about some of the things that I don't like about the double up roller and then I'll talk about the things that I do like. What I don't like about it, first off, is it's pretty big and bulky. Uh, I'm not gonna be carrying this to the gym to work out. Uh, it's simply just too big. Uh, I, I don't even wanna keep it in my car. I like to keep it at home and use it that way. I mean, you could technically just just bring just bring this out uh, and without the case, probably easier to carry this and but then you're only stuck with these two 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 rollers, which is okay. Uh, just carrying the whole system with you is going to be a little bit of a hassle. The other negative is that it's not made to roll out your back, but a way to get through that is to use it as a traditional roller. Basically, you take this out or use one of the other rollers. You can just roll your body like a traditional foam roller. That's one way to get around that. Overall, what do I think about this double up roller? You know what, I think it's great. Basically, I'll contribute this to the ease of use. It is really easy to use. I will use this whenever I'm watching TV. I use this at night whenever I'm about to go to sleep and want a little massage on my legs. That's when you're really feeling all those sore muscles on your legs. It's great for that. Because to be honest, I have a foam roller 
and I don't use it very much simply because I don't want to get on the ground and foam roll for a long time. This is just easier to use for me. You can use it standing up, laying down, whatever way that works for you. How much does this product cost? This product costs $129. I think they have a $10 discount code on the Double Up Roller website just because they just released this this month. So yeah, check it out. I think that this is a great product. Like I said, easy use is really what's gonna make you use a product daily compared to other products and it works. The muscle massaging action that it has, it's just great. I really have been enjoying this product. Good job in inventing it. I know that there are similar products to, the, to this, but I think that this has the most pressure. You can put the most pressure on there as you want. Sometimes I read that the spring-based one, uh, it's not enough pressure. So this one is all up to you on how much pressure you wanna put on your muscle. So uh, good job, Double Up Roller. I do have to say that I like this product. And uh, if you guys like foam rolling and like massages, probably this is gonna be a good buy for you. All right, guys, let me know what you think about this Double Up Roller. Do you think that it's something that you would like? Let me know in the comments down below. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.